everybody. We are back to Diagonal Farm. Uh, off camera, I went and got enough wood, and I was hoping for a pine cone, because I'm almost out of energy. But, uh, this game definitely said no to that. I cut down, like, four. But this dandelion will help us. In our quest, to get the potatoes. Actually, dandelions are really good. Considering they're, like, no effort to get. And you get quite a lot of them. Uh, the da daffodils give you zero energy, so they're a pain in the ass to get. Uh, who's want what? For one large amount of fast. Fuck that shit. Don't think I got Caroline yet. No, I did not. Yay! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine! Yay! These are the plant, like the plants that I've planted the last episode, and the potatoes are the ones you need for the bundle. Everything else is just extra stuff that you can do. Uh, some people will ask for on quest, and like the thing I looked there for the largemouth bass, and also personal preference. Some people like growing different things. But the oh, not I didn't want to click on the mail. These. Is what we've been, we were alive for. Damn. Potatoes are cool because you have a chance to get extra ones each time you uh, pull them out of the ground. Now, unfortunately, uh, actually, we don't have that many. Uh, in my game, I tried to optimize too much to the point it ruined the beginning of my summer because I just it would have been amazing if I got a rainy day. But I had to go so fucking long with no rain. And uh, when I finally got it was when I actually had all my uh, shit done. So we've got our scarecrow. Bam! That's perfect placement. No crows will get me. So we will... Actually... Don't really need sap for anything. You only really need sap for those, and I just get them for free. Uh, whoop, whoop, whoop. We are actually going to go hunting. See if I can't find me a radish, a horse radish, and also some squigglies. I'm just going to do one lap, and I can maybe shake some pine trees if I see any. See if I can get a pine cone. Nope. And then tomorrow we're going back in the mines. Because once we can get into the uh, Adventurer's Guild, we can actually have some fun. Yeah, we got a hundred bucks. Always check those. If you ever see that uh, pulsating, check it. Sometimes it's got money for you. Yay, a leak. Don't really need a leak, but we can eat the leak, which is probably what we'll have to do for the mines tomorrow. Because I doubt it's going to rain. We should have checked that. I usually don't check. I'm pretty sure we got Maru. Let's make sure. Yeah, I already got her. I usually don't check the weather, unless I really need it to rain so I can do shit. God, that sucked. I went like almost 10 days, no rain. It was really busting my balls. I would literally lose all my energy um, doing the, the farming stuff, like the watering in the beginning. Oh, it was brutal. And all I needed was rain, because all I had to do was go to the mine. I had like up to level 80 already. I just needed the gold ore. And then you can build something that like, if you're standing here, it waters all around you. So pretty much once we get to optimization, the middle will go away, but it'll be like, these will be touching, and then it'll be another two, and then you just go boop, 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 boop. And then you have a shit ton of um, shit getting done. But we will grab that, grab that, grab those, one of those, and that. And then two Z-Bed. Actually, let's see. Let's see. 
didn't expect a loss of pollen. So no um no rain for me. Yeah, I can make a burger. I've never actually made that survival burger. The big thirty-five bones. Damn. <laughs> the seventh of spring, and we got everything we need planted. Very good. And then, really, all that we really need to have to get is uh, five of the parsnips. I need uh, five gold star parsnips. Because we need that for the quality bundle. Which isn't too hard to get. Like, once you get everything you need, you literally need one of the cauliflower, the potato, the potatoes. And uh, the green beans, which will get 100%. Then the rest will just sell. But the parsnip, getting five of them. Not really hard, but pain in the ass nonetheless. Then once summer hits, summer is when I know it, like, it's either just because of the timing in the game, or just the fact that you can get um, corn. Or, uh, wheat. Once you start doing wheat... Oh my god, it's so good. Uh... Oh, yeah, it's just... That's just Robin apologizing for being a bitch. She was kind of bitchy. She was making fun of my house. In the beginning, she was apologizing, but I think she was apologizing because she wants my goddamn money. Robin's the carpenter, so she'll actually get a lot of my money. I was hoping, I was hoping. There's gotta be something with that, like, it's probably just an animation to make it look more lifelike. But, there's a lot of videos out there talking about possible secrets in this game. So, I would like to think maybe I can find one that is cool. Have Diagonal actually become something for Stardew Valley instead of just another Let's Player of it. So we need to get 10 slimes, and as far down as we can. Look at that, he give us two right off the bat. Oh yeah, we need shit tons of ore. Oh, I, I hate it when they slime you. As you're seeing, you want to get them right up against the wall or a rock. I am getting fucking wrecked. Um, we'll eat that. So that kind of sucked, but if you can get the slimes up against the wall there, they don't even have enough time. They don't they don't have enough recovery frames to bring in a fighting term. There we go. It's fucking crab. I I lose you. So we are gonna stay away from the uh, big stones. So we're not dying that much to get stones. We need... Oh, perfect. But what we really need is to get as far down as possible. So as I said, 40 is our goal. We must hit 40. Ooh, I like those. Cave carrots are really good. You do need one for a bundle, but I've never actually finished off that bundle. You need a lot of shit. So we are probably just going to use those to eat. Actually, my management for this playthrough is a lot better. Just because, like, this is like my third time playing through. Uh, anybody who doesn't know me, like, when I do a game, like, I'm, I'm doing it with Dark Souls 3, which, this game? I'm a huge Dark Souls fan. Anybody who watches the channel knows I have some Dark Souls shit. Um... But Dark Souls 3, I've barely gone through the the opening. I'm only like two hours into that game. And I bought it opening day. Just this game is ruining all other games for me. Uh, I wonder if we're going to get this leak. I'd rather be safe than sorry. Oh, come on. Sometimes that's the worst thing about this game is sometimes you, you just default to attacking a certain way, and it just screws you over. 
Luckily, it's not too bad here, but in the lower levels, if you're getting really bad drops for armor, like for your boots, it really sucks. You can just get, you can just get wrecked. How many slimes do I have? Should be pretty damn close. Yeah, we just need three more. Damn. Oh, look at that. I'm not talking about the slime. I'm talking about this up here. Oh, oh I'm in love. It'd be awesome if one of these became stairs, too. And there's another slime here. Beauty. Actually, that should be enough slimes. As I said, once you once you get them in a corner, you're, you're golden. Bam. Now we should just be enter the hall. Yeah. Which we'll either do. Today? No, probably tomorrow. Actually, it's not even open yet. It doesn't open up till 2 o'clock. Damn. We are having a very good run right now. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of that sap. Sorry to sap ya. Now what we just really need is those stairs. I really want to make it to level 10. If I can make it to level 10 right now, we are ahead of the game. And it's gonna do- oh fuck, I'm an idiot. Oh my god. I totally knew we had it already. Oh, well, I, I did it for the stone. Look at this, two veins, there's a fucking amethyst down here. God damn. Here. I just, and I'm floor 8. I literally need to. Oh, it's right there! Damn! The stairs are coming too fast! Literally just need to finish this floor. What? Right there! Damn! We need that. Actually, yeah, we'll just eat the cave carrot. Because I need one of those for... There we go, look at that. We're already getting on bundles I can't even get close to. Damn, it just stares galore. Um... Hmm. Oh, fuck me. Derp. Yeah, we got- we got a sap back. That was gonna do an ore run, just... Probably just that. Yep. Floor 10! And we got some boots! What can I try- ah, one coal. That's not- that's... Ah, I should've actually just threw it on the floor. Fuck me. Oh, it's just one coal. There we go! So as I said, the mines aren't too hard. If you know what you're doing and you know what you're looking for, and also I've gone through, like, the mines before, uh, the rooms are always the same shape, each floor, but it'll be different what's on said floors. I don't think I have anything to sell you. There's a wooden blade. Uh, yeah. I normally don't buy the weapons, but... Because we are trying to get down as far as we can, it is really worthwhile to grab that. Because the damage output is... My damage output is now, like, almost doubled. I think that sword's, like, 1 to 4, the rusty sword, and then now I've got 3 to 7. And also, it's only 250 bucks. That's... It's not asking much. Now we can start making ores, although I got rid of my coal. As I said, it's just one coal. We should be fine. I'll be able to make one furnace. I usually get four furnaces going. I don't know, actually five, because I usually build four, and then you eventually get one from the, um, 
what do you call it? From... Oh my god, I can't even think of what it's called. The museum. There we go. Uh, I need to drop some of this shit. Uh, open! I'm gonna sell those. Keep, keep. I almost have enough to build two. <laughs> But we will start doing this. Uh, Cause click on this quick enough. Oh yeah, we were supposed to go talk to the wizard. Let's go. Uh, might be too late. I want to screw it up. Wizard tower. Let's see. Let's see. I might not even be able to get down there because of all this shit. Well, at least get him. Ah, damn it. Nah. And right, we'll get the path built. So this really doesn't scrub optimization. I'm just a day behind on this, but I don't even have anything to hand in yet. Oh. So we are still good. And we'll get this done. No, it just finishes. Oh, yeah. Okay, it just took it away. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. Also, I did have the tech axe on me. Kind of a dart. But we will. And I'll bring a hoe. Bring the hoe damn thing. I don't know why I like saying that. It's super dumb. Getting caught on the edges. Uh, as I said, it's not a good idea to cut all the grass. But you want to save that for the silo, but it is nice to have a path because it does slow you down. There we go. Now run. Run, little Jeremiah. Also, you can find horse radishes down here, too. As I said, they usually don't start showing up till a bit later, but sometimes, sometimes you get lucky. Rounds a long way. Let's hope he's still in here. Let's hope he lets me in. It is eight o'clock. Damn girl. So, this is the wizard. Oh, come in. I have been expecting you. So this guy knows my plight when I was all freaking out at those things I saw. He is the master of the seven. Keeper of the secret, you get the point. So he has foreseen my arrival. Here I'd like to show you something. Zip. Behold my penis! But yeah, he, uh, he knows what I saw. I shouldn't be checking my phone. <laughs> just need to see, because my phone did go off. I just need to make sure what it was. They call themselves Juminos? I think it's Juminos. They can speak with him. And they've moved into the community center. You found a golden written scroll, or a scroll written. Lost me in the So he runs away. With magic. I wish he could get, like, a teleport spell. Oh my god! I found the note. So he's able to decipher the language at that time. All they want is gifts and they will aid me. So he's gonna teach me how to speak this language by making me drink this horrid, horrid shit. You gets! Come here! 
slow walk. Favorite for a moss grub. Caramel top gold stool. Can you smell it? Yeah, he's a odd one. He wants to wants me to drink up. This fucking wizard. Glug glug. Do I pass out here? No, I just get super sick. Looks like I'm super sick, but I'm becoming one with the woods. One with the forest. This is actually super fucking trippy. <laughs> I feel like I gotta leave. It's almost like a bonus game. Click him. Fuck him. You imagine if that actually unlocked something? Me clicking everything. <laughs> that would be fucked up. Not gonna read their shit. Well, let me back in. Let's see if it'll. Yeah, see, you gotta talk to him outside of, um. Outside of his tower, apparently. But, we have to run all the way home now. Because we are over time. But I wanna get that done. Oh, jeez. Might pickaxe a few rocks on the way back. But, it is getting too dark. See, this is why I like having those torches. I just like having them all over my farm. Gives it a nice, cool, glowy look. There we go. Nice and clear. And we shall go to the bed beds. So, oh, I actually got tons of time. Tons of time. Even though I just said we're over. Just gonna get rid of all this shit. I like going to bed with nothing in my pockets. Beam. I did not do that. Either. Beam. There we go. So thank you everybody for tuning in. And have yourselves a wonderful night.